what is shaking homies? Today we are going to take a look at the Atra by Reticulated Return Tops. And I am a big fan of this yo-yo. I already filmed the unboxing and the review portion of the video. So let's go over there and let's check it out. All right, so here is the packaging. We got recticyoyo.com, which you can purchase all of the Reticulated Return Top Shops yo-yos at that website as well as Yo-Yo Sam. So if you're wondering where to buy this, I just told you. And links will be in the description as always. So here's how it's packaged in this cool like cardboardy thing. So we're gonna open it up here. And first thing, we get a ton of stickers. I remember that when I got uh, reviewed the BOA as well, there was just like tons of stickers, which are really cool. Um, then we also get like business cards. Um, so you could, there's, uh, if you need to get in touch with the company uh, or have any questions or anything, I'm sure they'll be happy to um, answer all your questions and everything. So very cool right there. And then as far as these stickers, these are pretty sick. Huh, awesome. Put those on my coffee pot. A very cool orange and uh, yellow string. Okay. And I really like this bag actually. Quite nice. And I have no idea what color this is or anything, so. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, oh yeah, check it out, it's like crazy hot pink. That is freaking awesome. I love that. That is like pink, pink, pink. I really like the shape of this. Uh, it's kind of just like your modern um, shape and size. Um, you know, kind of you know, slightly, slightly smaller in diameter to uh, you know just the average area. Like here, here's a here's a hot diggity. It's actually just a little bit smaller in diameter than a hot diggity. A little bit wider, um, but it's got this nice rounded profile. Uh, this little cut here, fat thumb grind lip. It does look like you'll be able to do finger spins um, as well as maybe some. Uh, what do you call this down talent? I can't remember which. What do you call those talent grinds or whatever the heck you call it? The spike tricks and uh, all that good stuff. But I really like the pink first stuff and <laughs> with the yellow. Something about the, with the yellow pad. It just looks really nice. Yeah, very, very tight. <laughs> we got a concave bearing. Uh, I like how it is not blasted here. It just gives it that like real elegant look to it. Very beautiful yo-yo. Oh my god. Absolutely loving it. Uh, and this orange string is actually going to look really cool in there too. Um, really, really cool. Okay, I'll put all the, spe uh, the specs on the screen. Um, shout out to Neil Baker. He was nice enough to send me these yo-yos and he sent me over all the specs. Uh, and all that good stuff. So I don't have to get out any of the tools or anything. But it feels like somewhere like 65, 66 grams. I'm right in that sweet spot there. Oops. <laughs> Already banging it on stuff, I haven't even played with it yet. Oops. Making everyone cringe. It's okay, it's fine. Yeah, it feels kind of similar weight. I, I can already tell you I'm probably going to like it because it's got some similar characteristics to my signature yo-yo that I play with all the time. But, yeah, super awesome. They also sent me another yo-yo, um, which we'll check out shortly, but... Without further ado, let's go over there, let's throw the string on the baby, and let's have some Okay guys, we are all strung up here. So I had to throw a yellow string on it because that orange string was like blending into the floor. Uh, it was too hard for me to see. So this one has more of a contrast <laughs> with my background I'm using, or my floor I'm looking at, I mean. Okay, so first things first, uh, it feels kind of similar to like... A Yo-Yo Jam Hitman, like if they remade the Hitman and made it to today's standards, you'd feel kind of similar to this. Uh, it's got that like same kind of shape, rounded, rounded edges, and then it's like super rim weighted. I um, mean, it feels very, um, very powerful. Like it, it feels like it's gonna sleep um, forever. Um, so it can finger spin. Actually, finger spins really well. 
thumb grind really well also. Um, but just its finish in general, as well as how smooth it is, it's going to make any grinds pretty darn easy to do. Yeah, great overall, great feeling yo-yo. Definitely has a unique feel to it. It's not just like your, you know, your standard competition style yo-yo. This is like, you know, something a little different. Yeah, I like that it's a little smaller too. It has, you know, it's a nice area. Whoops, you can fit it in your pocket, you know, but it still can compete with like everything else. But yeah, very long spinning. That's like the one thing I'm really getting off this is it, it just feels like it will spin forever. Yeah, but a really long spinning yo-yo. Um, honestly, feels great. You can finger spin with it. You can do all those, all that gimmicky type stuff. Oops. Response here is really nice. Very easy to regen it back out. Yeah, but I'm, I'm really digging this thing. And this finish, too, is, like, incredible. And the rounded edges makes it really nice for, like, like, I do that a lot where I'll throw it out, and then I'll, like, hop it off my hand and toss it back out. Um, because of the round edges, you don't even, like, feel it. Like, sometimes I even use, like, my head diggity, and it bangs off my knuckles kind of hard and stuff. Uh, this, this was uh, really nice. Oops. But yeah, it kind of reminds me of like a new age Joyo Jam Hitman. <laughs> yeah, and the response is like perfect. I don't know. I really, really like this thing. Uh, they also sent me another yo-yo, so look forward to that review. But uh, thank you to Neil Baker and everybody over at uh, Reticulated Return Tops. You guys totally kick ass. Thank you guys for watching, and peace out.